Ice cream's not such a bad idea. That would be a nice treat. It would evening. be a nice treat, yeah. You wear a jacket, you're sweating. You're like, <laughs> give me some ice cream. Temperatures are at 60 degrees, which yeah. is actually our normal temperature for early April. Wow. So it is definitely warm out there. I hope they're prepared for long lines up there in Seattle for that salt and straw. I'm sure those they, they will have long lines. So long. <laughs> but yeah, ice cream sounds pretty good right now. All right, let's take a look at the forecast. We do have pretty much the same song and dance over the next couple of days. Seaside today, let's start with the time lapse of low clouds, rain. Most of the rain stayed along the coast. Here's 5 p.m. It slowed down a little bit, but uh, you might have a few more showers as we go into tonight. Portland today, about the same thing. Matter of fact, though, we stayed away from any sort of rain. We just had the low clouds, and they were here this morning, and they stuck around. We had a few breaks this afternoon, maybe a sun break here or there, but overall, it was pretty gray for our Sunday. All right, so here's the rain totals. As I mentioned, most of the rain was along the coast, especially areas up towards Astoria, down towards Tillamook. Uh, the rest of us in the Valley Dry, Hood River Dry, the Dallas Dry, Pendleton, quick splash, but yeah, that's it. We haven't see much. This high pressure off to the southwest right here, so where you see things are just blue pretty much, uh, that is just kicking all the clouds out of here. And this is going to shift to the northeast by the time we get into midweek, and that's going to allow for drier conditions here in the Pacific Northwest. So I don't have any significant rainfall, any significant snowfall, or really a lot of moisture uh, coming close to us here in the meantime. All right, so today's high 60 degrees. Guess what? 60 degrees tied a record high that was set back in 1992. Eugene broke a record today, topping off at 61. As I mentioned, our normal high is about 50. We're about 10 degrees warmer today. This is early April temperatures. Here's 6 p.m. We still have some scattered showers to the north. We're looking into the future now, so this is one of our weather models. And a lot of eastern Oregon and over towards central Oregon is dry, and you're probably going to remain dry. We go into the overnight hours. Still some showers are possible through areas of the Cascades and into the coast. A lot of us are just going to stay overcast. Maybe a little bit of fog is possible and dry as we go into Monday morning. Those temperatures cooling down tonight into the upper 40s. And uh, if you're waking up early tomorrow morning, might want a light rain jacket, but I don't expect a lot of precipitation as we go through our Monday. So some dry time back in the forecast. Eastern Oregon, you might have a little bit of rain or some snowfall for the high uh, elevations there, but not a lot of moisture to work with there either. Let me get you to the seven day forecast so you can make some plans. Wednesday, we're going to be very close to 60 degrees again. You can see a few passing clouds too. Uh, so this is when that high pressure moves in. Temperatures go up and we see more sunshine. A quick disturbance on Thursday, which might bring in a splash. But Friday, Saturday and Sunday, back into the mid 50s uh, with more mild weather in the forecast. So great outdoor weather, uh, perfect for any sort of yard. We usually get this in April. Yes, yeah. again, this is like the 60 degree mark, early April, late March. Wow. Yes. Joseph, thank you. I love it.